All right, so there was a question on the Facebook forums. Uh, someone had an issue trying to figure out how to import all their Carvera settings into Fusion 360. Uh, so I thought I'd try to help out real quick, not really in depth. And I apologize for the quality here. This is spur of the moment, but let's see what we can do. Now, I have already downloaded from the Carvera website the Fusion 360 Profiles zip file. I'm going to right click on that and extract it somewhere to get all its internal files. Uh, we have a couple tool profiles and we have two machine definitions and we have a post processing script. So that's all we need for that and I can actually close this window. I'm just going to minimize it for now though. Now going into Fusion 360, I'm going to go over to the manufacturing workspace under manage we have to do a few different things step by step. We're going to start with the tool library. We'll click on that. We'll go into local. There's nothing in it, which is fine. We're going to right click on local. I was lost for a long time because I could never figure out how to get this top bar, which includes an import feature, to work. But by right clicking on local, I can do import libraries. I can navigate to the Carvera downloads that I had, and I have three different tools profiles. I have example tools, PCB tools, and spare tools. If I just highlight each of those, I can import all of them at the same time, hit open, and now we have all three libraries. Fantastic. We can close that next step, we go back to manage, we did the tools, now we'll define the machine. Machine library, exactly the same as before, although I do have an import here, so if I go to my machines, local, I can hit import, pull it out to select from my computer, from the desktop, we'll go into our Carvera downloads, and again, I can highlight both of these, oh no, I can only do one at a time. So we've got the three axis, we highlight that, hit open, import again, select from my computer, the four axis, and open. Now both machines. Now it is giving us a warning that we do not have a post defined. That is our next step. I'll go ahead and close the machine library definitions. Again, going back into manage, we'll go to post library, local, import, and the CPS file, double click, Oh, we're done. That is everything. Close that and just to double check, go back to that machine library definitions. And we'll see that both of those errors are gone, that it has found the post processor for the Carvera. And that's everything. You're ready to fly. As far as how to use them, I'll leave that up to you. But the question was how to actually get them in there, and I think we've covered that. So enjoy. I hope you get your machine soon. I hope I get my machine soon. <laughs> Very much looking forward to it.